let's see the next question next question we have a figure shows a uniform meter rule placed on the fulcrum at its midpoint o having a weight 40 gram force at 10 centimeter mark so 40 gram force is at 10 centimeter mark fulcrum is at 50 and 20 gram force is at 90 so we have to see is this meter rule is equilibrium for that we have to calculate the clockwise and anti-clockwise moment so clockwise moment we have first of all see who is creating clockwise 40 gram to creating anti-clockwise this 20 is creating yes clockwise so force is 20 and perpendicular distance is 90 minus 50 so i got 20 into 40 that is 800 gram for centimeter after that we have who is creating anti-clockwise movement anti-clockwise movement we have to find out so anti-clockwise movement we have this 40 is creating anti-clockwise movement how much 40 and this is perpendicular distance 50 minus 10 40 into 50 minus 10 so this become 40 into 40 so this becomes 1600 gram force now you can clearly see anti-clockwise movement is more than clockwise movement so first question is that is this meter rule is equilibrium if they are same so yes it is equilibrium but now they are not same so here we have no so answer is no no this is not not in equilibrium if it is not how will the rule will turn which movement is more anti-clockwise movement is more it is 1600 so you can write here it is it will turn in anti-clockwise direction okay it will turn in anti-clockwise direction how can the rule be bought in equilibrium by using an additional weight so we have to put now additional weight 40 gram force Ab, unhone, hume, 40 gram force de diya. we have to place this 40 gram force in such a way that it is in equilibrium so where to uh, this in this part we have more movement so here though we not place this so where we have to keep this we have to place 40 gram force here on this side or basically we can say on the right side at a distance x okay so now what we will do we will do clockwise movement is equals to anti-clockwise who is creating clockwise so clockwise movement is creating this 40 is creating clockwise 20 is creating so for c20 into perpendicular distance this distance you can directly see it is 40 okay so 40 plus this is also 40 into x and is equals to who is creating anti-clockwise 40 into 40 this distance is 40 so we got 40 into 40 so now let's calculate so this become i know this is 1600 this is 40x and this is 800 so 1600 minus 800 we got 40x is equals to 800 so 0 and 0 cancel out and we got 20 so x we got 20 centimeter so we we got only x value that is 20 centimeter but not the mark so here i have 50 so 50 plus 20 how much we got so we got the mark at 70 centimeter so additional mark we or uh, additional weight 40 gram force we have to place at a mark of 70 centimeter okay so this question is also very important